This is part one for wrapping the Miata. So we are uh, basically, we're sanding the whole car right now um, for all the chip marks and any like impurities in the car. Uh, we're just sanding that down because you want to have a flat surface and a, a very good like clean surface to wrap the car. So we're, we got like 180 grit and then we're gonna go around with uh, 320 or 400 grit and just like smooth everything out. There's a lot of chip marks on the car since it's, uh, it was like 23, 24 years old. So um, we're doing doing that. That's like part one, and then after that, we'll have to wash the car, play bar it, and uh, it should be ready after we disassemble everything. So that is what we are doing currently. So here we go. Okay, well, would you explain what you're doing right now? I'm just using this nice, this nice sandpaper to uh, smooth out all of the seams here. Yes. Um, just trying to take out any. Any little little nick you can. I'm trying to use the light. Yeah. Oh, that one as well. So like this would be horrible. I'm not gonna wrap this trunk, so that, don't have to sand that down. But that is a huge example of what we would have to sand down. This is where I wall tap the wall, so we had to sand this down. It's nice and smooth now. Stuff around the gas thing, just the paint corroded, so I had to sand that down. Got a mark right here that I'm working on. Just just little marks all around the car, and also like a big job. As you guys know. This is gonna be the front bumper because you know we had the wreck and da da da. So we have to sand that all down, and uh, that's that's the job that we are doing for part one. And then we gotta clean the car. Woo! Ian's doing his oil. Heck yeah! Finally, I've been cleaning this off for like three weeks. Dude, this is it pretty bad. Man. You want to tell the audience that you drove six thousand miles in this car, not change the oil? Yeah. But you can go seven on it, right? Because you have eh. oil. Yeah. No. Nah, you shouldn't do that. No, I, I probably should have changed it at four or five, yeah. realistically, but I waited until six because I. It's all good. Was, I don't it's know why, good. but it's oh. fine. Hey, you see? Some of them will come out. Starting on part two. So now we are in the process of just sanding a little bit more and then we're gonna go wash the car, clay bar it, and then tomorrow we will probably start taking everything off the car. Kev right now is finishing up the front bumper. Yeah, I saw before like, it's pretty bad after the wreck. We, we're, getting yeah. it, we're getting it sanded down, it's not gonna be perfect. Took the teeth off the car. See that, ooh, look at that intercooler. Anyway, that's where my front lip got ripped off. The bolts are still there, so that's good. Cause I'm gonna be ordering another one. Took the inserts out, gonna get intakes right here. But I mean, like the car is pretty much sanded down. The bumpers will probably, a grim will probably tell us that we'll have to get a little bit more sanding on them. But I mean, that's the toughest part right here. Around the other car, like we just sanded in the edges where there's like rough spots. Right here, back here. Not too bad. The rear bumper, I'm not too sure what I want to do yet because I took the whole back bar off so the bumper kind of fits funny now. But I mean, I might take the whole bumper off or I might just go uh, rear bash bar and paint it, paint it teal or something like that. I don't know. But And we also have to take the plastic dip off this because we're going to be wrapping this trunk with the wing. But I mean, it's coming along. It's coming along. I'm so excited. This weekend, it is getting wrapped. The wrap has been delivered. So, <laughs> boys, you don't even know. This wrap is crazy. Crazy. I don't think I've ever seen it on a Miata before. Yeah, I mean like. I have never seen this wrap on a Miata, or really like many cars. This is like a very rare kind of a wrap. Woo! It's, what gonna, do you guys think it's gonna be fire. Comment down below what you think. Comment down below. In a previous video and on like Instagram, I kind of gave you gave like some that I'm not doing, so go check those out. But comment down below what you think, bro. She's not gonna be white for very much longer, dude. The last three years of ownership, man, this car's been white. 
I never wanted to change the light because I love it. But I was like, it's time because I got that wreck now. The bumper's like screwed up. So I was like, I think it's time. The paint's kind of getting old, 25 years old or something like that. So is it, it was time for a change. And it's gonna be a track car now, so it's gotta look cool. I mean, she's gotta, gotta bring her up in uh, 2018, make her look, look a little bit cooler. I've also decided to go with my new wheel setup, so I know what I'm gonna be getting. Um, I'll probably be ordering them after like I get the wrap finished and everything, but you guys knew that I had that Bonte S once before they got all they all got destroyed bent and like cracked and everything from from the wreck so um, Just comment down below what you guys think I'm gonna be getting um, I might throw it up on the screen right here of three options that I'll be going with I'll probably do that. Yeah, I'll put three options that I was looking at um, I wanted to change it up, but I think I think I'm probably going to be staying with the Avanti S1 Storms because the setup was just just unbelievable. But comment down below like which ones that you want on the screen right here. What do you think would look cool? Uh, just like the setup was so good, so I think I'm gonna stick with it. And it's it's a super light wheel. It's only 12 pounds. It it's it looks good on the car. And uh, but uh, definitely comment down below what you guys think of the wheel. Alrighty guys, so thank you guys so much for watching through there. I think the audio went bad on me because the mic wasn't plugged in. That's a huge mistake as a YouTuber. It destroys all of your footage. Cringeworthy, I know, but I right now I'm watching a Grim and actually Ravi as well. He's, you'll meet him in a little bit here, but they are right now wrapping the front bumper. The rest of the car is already done. That video is coming very soon for you guys, but I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. We are so close to 4,000 subscribers. Smash that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out, GPG. See you in the next one.